One of the cool things about the open rail system is that it's compatible with Makerslide. They both share the same bearing plates as well as V-Groove wheels. Another great feature is that you will also have the ability to run continuous lengths by joining the rail end to end. One of our favorite features of the open rail system is its unique ability to interlock and create a single rail system with V-Rails on both sides. Here's a good example of how the open rail system might be used for a Z-axis on a lightweight DLP 3D printer. Like block and rail systems that are used in high-end mills, you can add multiple bearing plates and gain precision and strength. Adding open rail to wider extrusions makes for a strong, lightweight beam for CNC mills. Your mounting hardware will be included with each length of open rail. Installing open rail in your extrusion is simple. Just place the screw through the pre-drilled mounting hole and affix with a T-nut. Once the T-nuts are installed, it's just a matter of aligning them as they slide into the slot. Alignment of open rail is straightforward. The inside edge of the arrow simply sits against the extrusion while you tighten down the screws. Mounting plates and other accessories can be mounted directly to the extrusion, simply moving open rail out of the way. This allows for multiple configurations and endless mounting possibilities. This is a feature that you're sure to appreciate. The ability to turn wide extrusion into linear guide systems allows you to create extremely stable gantry platforms. Open rail is hard coat anodized type 3. This allows for extremely high wear resistance. Now we can use both metal and plastic V-wheels for either heavy or light duty machining. Open Rail has so many possible configurations, you can build practically anything. We believe Open Rail is the economical solution for taking open source builds to the next level. Please join us and support this Kickstarter project. Never knew in the kick. Never knew of. Oh.